In this video, I will show you how to transfer from Mega to Google Drive. So there are a few ways to do this. The first one is to simply download everything and then upload it on Google Drive. This is the best option if you have only a very few amount of small files. So that you can just go through, click on download right here, do a standard download, and then just wait for it to download on your PC and then go to Google Drive and simply upload it right there. So that's the first option, but if you have a huge amount of files, then that can take quite a lot of time. Then what you can use is this tool called Mult Cloud. So this allows you to transfer across clouds. So you can just get started for free, no credit card required. So I'll just sign up with Google. And then from there, you can then choose which platforms you want to use. So for this example, you can see right here the personal cloud. So I'll use Mega. Then here, just enter your email and password and then click add mega now it will go and connect so i have now connected mega which you can see here in the left now you want to go and connect drive so you can just do the normal google drive and then you will need to sign in with google so then click continue continue and now i have also connected my google drive so now here you can see my files in google drive but also in mega so here what i can now do is just select all of my files and then select copy to and then here select google drive and then click on ok so now what it's going to do it is going to take all the files from my mega folder and upload them to my google drive so you can see right here the progress so I'll just show you when it's done. So then you will be able to see them right here. Now this is the one that I already did earlier. So I'll just go and remove that one. So you can see right here it is processing. Now my Wi-Fi is pretty slow, so therefore it is not going very fast. But for you, it may be a lot faster, but it will just run in the background. So just wait for them to finish. And then you have successfully transferred your mega files to Google Drive. If this video was helpful, please consider leaving a like and subscribing to my channel. With that being said, I will see you in the next video.